Hey YouTube land, welcome to the land of the midnight sun. Uh, just found me a little wooded area, I'm just checking it out. Found me a nice shady spot, it's gonna take me a little nap if the mosquitoes will leave me alone. They're pretty bad out here right now. I got a few hours till I have to be at the airport to pick up the kids. So I'm just hanging out, didn't have much to do today. Gonna go fishing tomorrow. Probably make another video tomorrow because we're gonna catch, cook, clean, all of it right there at the lake tomorrow. Um, I got a little grill and a cast iron skillet. And so we're just gonna clean and cook anything we catch. So just hanging out right now. Like I said, I guess I jumped the gun. I started, had, I had to go help a friend of mine move a portable building uh, on some land he's clearing out. And uh, when I got done with that and I just, nothing else to do today. It's pretty boring without anybody here. I don't know what that is, squirrel raising hell at me. Anyway, uh, so I just drove to Fairbanks. Got to be at the airport here in a little while. So until then, I figured I'd just find me a nice shady spot put the sun to my back and just sit here and take a little nap and yeah I've been doing a lot of trout fishing here lately and they pretty fun to catch you know always got to keep your eyes open for moose or bear so it's kind of what I'm doing right now of course I'm always packing <laughs> I got my 45 on my hip but uh, you never know when something will come out of the woods. So yeah, yeah, this is uh, the big muddy city of Fairbanks right now. Yeah, so tomorrow I'll make that video about catching trout and stuff. I'll just let the kids do most of the fishing while I video or whatever. And then uh, we'll clean everything and cook it right there on the beach and eat it as we catch it. Ow, mosquito, get off my hand. Anyway, what is that? Oh, nothing. Okay. I always got to look for anything dark. You never know what it'll be. The lake I normally go to, I guess uh, last year they had a grizzly attack there where the bear chased some people and they ran into the lake and then they ended up drowning in the lake trying to stay away from the grizzly bear. So the grizzly bear didn't get them, but there, he was the cause of it anyway. So. Yeah, it's been kind of weird, you know, cause the sun never goes down all the way. You know, I was out the other morning, 2.30, Two, yeah, about 2.30 in the morning. You don't even need headlights. It's so bright out. So it's different. You know, it'll be opposite in the wintertime. You know, because uh, in the winter, we don't have any... The light goes away. We get less and less light, you know, after the summer solstice. So by the time uh, the winter solstice hits, and like, so somewhere around December 21st, they call that the darkest day of the year. The sun will come up here at about 11 in the morning and go down at 2.30 in the afternoon. So maybe a couple hours of daylight and that's it. Yeah, I'm pretty excited about getting to see the kids. You know, it's been a while. Uh, Jacob was supposed to leave. Uh, I bought him a ticket to go down there and get them. And he was supposed to leave at like 7 o'clock Friday night. And then the plane got screwed up and he got delayed and had to take another plane ride. So he didn't actually get to leave until six o'clock Saturday morning. And then this morning, of course, they were going to leave at like three and supposed to get here at seven. And then, of course, the stupid ass plane screwed up again. So they got delayed by like two hours. I think that's the last time I'll use American Airlines. I'll just stick with Alaska. It's more expensive, but they're a higher quality plane. Safest in America is what I've been told. So I'll just spring for that next time. <sighs> Stupid mosquitoes.
Yeah, I'm just sitting under a tree relaxing. Anyway, y'all have a good day, and I'll talk to you soon. Like I said, I'm just going to sit, sit around here and wait until I got to go pick them up. Talk to you later. Bye.